I'm in the music room at the American Club, and I wanted to share with you what I do most mornings of the week. I get up at around 4 o'clock in the morning, or actually 3.30, and I walk from 4 until about 4.30, 4.45, around the neighborhood. And then, after coming back home and getting ready, I leave at around 7 o'clock almost every morning and get to the American Club, which takes me about 10 minutes. And at 7.30, they open up the music room, the gymnasium where they have the music room. We have a golf simulator and we also have three squash courts and a huge gym that has three basketball courts in it, two sideways, one long ways. And I get in one of the two music rooms we have, this one, the burgundy one. And interesting today, <laughs> I decided to wear my burgundy shirt or sweater. It's kind of chilly out. And I come in here every morning and I practice my saxophone. Now I'm going to show you how I put it together. Unfortunately, for those of you that might just be listening, you won't get a chance to see it. So you're going to have to go over to YouTube to see the video that I've put up that shows you in fast motion or time-lapse photography, what it looks like when I come in every morning, how I set up my laptop and um, my my saxophone and get ready for my lesson. Now I have several books I use. I have 101 movie hits for tenor sax. I do that and I've, I've been practicing for three years now and I can now read music and I'm taking an online course in music theology or music theory, I'm sorry, music theory. And it's interesting. I really enjoy what I've been doing. I'm not very good, but I hope to be someday. But I must say, I do enjoy playing. And you can hear this if it's on a podcast. I'll play, I'll play one song. Well, I haven't really warmed up yet, but I'll play one song for you. And you can be the judge as to if three years has been worth it for me to be practicing the sax or should I just give it up and take up something that I'm not good at but I've done good at and that's bowling. My mother's really good at bowling. <laughs> but tell me what you think. Is it something I should pursue or something I should give up and forget about? Let me see. I'm not sure how much of me I can be see in this video but here we go. Um, let me see. Let me warm up a little bit first. <laughs> Just tell me what you think. That's it. I'm going to start practicing now. But I thought I'd do a little short video and um, tell you what my mornings are like. So that's part of it. Maybe one morning I'll take you out on a walk with me. It's kind. It's, it's really dark most of the time when I leave in the morning, but it's um, refreshing. I like going out when no one else is outside. I feel like every most people are sleeping at that time. And it just gives me a chance to recharge. I love my mornings here. Um, Thank you for all the comments I got on the last 
motorcycle trip I took um, to Hakone. That was really pleasing. I guess I'm kind of stuck on this social media binge I'm going on right now, but I really appreciate all the comments I get. And if you have any comments about anything you'd like to know about Japan, anything like you'd like to know about what I've been doing here this 40 plus decade, 40, 40 plus years, yeah, I've been in Japan 46 years now. Right, I came here in 1974. And um, the longest I've ever been away is a month in that 46 years. I love this country. It's a really nice place to live. Anyway, that's another story for another time. Thank you. Please subscribe to this channel or to the podcast. And I have some interesting people lined up for future podcasts. And I think you're going to like hearing about their stories or listening to us talk together. It's not really um, anything other than a time for us to sit down and just talk. Some of them I've been with for, some of them I've known for a very long time. Most of the people I've known for a long time. But some of them are um, not that long. And when I say not that long, I think two years, three years isn't that long a time compared to the time that I've been here. Anyway, with no further ado, have a great day. If it's daytime where you are, have a great evening if it's evening time where you are, and um, subscribe. Mm -hmm.